Hi, Dr. Brad Holden, Health for Spine and Wellness, and today we're gonna to cover the topic of cold laser therapy. We'll start by covering what it is, what effects cold laser has on your body, and then we're gonna jump into some frequently asked questions that I get in my office about cold laser therapy. So let me start by saying cold laser therapy is simply a laser unit that emits a laser beam uh, in the form of photon energy. And this photon energy really affects our body on the cellular level. So when these photons penetrate through the skin and hit the cells, it's gonna stimulate the mitochondria or the powerhouse of the cell to produce more ATP. And this ATP is really the energy unit of the cell. You see, anytime we have an injury in our body, there are um, repairs that need to be made to the tissue. And there's also waste products that need to be removed from the area from the injury. So the analogy I like to use is that of a construction site. Imagine you have this building that is up and a storm comes by and knocks this building down. Well, we need to have workers on the site with a wheelbarrow, you know, removing some of the, the damaged material that's fallen. And we also need to have construction guys on the site to rebuild the building that's been knocked down. So basically this laser would be like putting more people on the site, both removing the waste and rebuilding it, and also really, really speeds them up so they're being more efficient than normal. Some of the effects that we have with cold laser therapy is uh, increased blood flow, right? Decreased scar tissue, decreased inflammation, and increased cellular growth. So it's really doing a lot to aid the body in healing itself. So some of the questions I'll get is, what does it feel like, or more importantly, does it hurt? Actually, cold laser therapy, when you're getting it done, does not hurt at all. Most people report just feeling a slight warmth in the area being treated. Uh, some people notice really nothing during the treatment itself when it's actually being applied. What are the side effects? Well, over the past 25 years, as cold th laser therapy has really taken off in popularity, there's been no real long-term uh, side effects that have been noted whatsoever. Some people, although it's never happened in my office, and I've been doing this on a weekly basis for the past 10 years, some people though can have some skin irritation if they're sensitive to light. So that's uh, something if you're really sensitive to light that you may wanna check out. But again, out of the hundreds of patients we've treated with it, we've never had one issue with any skin sensitivity, but it has been documented with some individuals. What is the average treatment time? Typically, it's a pretty brief treatment time. You're looking from five to 10 minutes per body part that's treated. So if you have like tennis elbow or patellar tendonitis or runner's knee, something like that, you're looking at about a five to 10 minute treatment time per area um, to, get, to get it treated. How long before you'll, you'll feel results? Well, typically you'll feel results a lot of people just after one session. So obviously it's gonna take more than one session to actually address the underlying issue that's there. Usually in between six and 12 sessions will resolve most issues, but most people do report some immediate change even after the first, first visit. And then, so what are some of the common conditions? Well, some of the common conditions we see will be anything from acute low back pain, um, knee tendonitis, tennis elbow, any sort of uh, rotator cuff injury, any of those things that work very, very well with cold laser therapy along as sometimes people with TMJ issues can also be helped by um, cold laser therapy as well. So I hope you found this video informative and give you a little better glimpse on what cold laser therapy is and how it may be able to benefit you. Thank you.